Hi, I'm Rowan. I'm nine years old and I drew the mud flow tag. Um, I had two points on me and I finally drew it. Lucky. I was like so lucky yeah. to get something like that. All right, we got our first bull spotted. I just spotted him right after we sat down. Give him oh. a couple bulls. Dude, that's a big one. Yeah, is that oh a big my one? God, that's a big one. Yeah. Oh my god. No way. Oh, this Check this out. Check this out. That's big. Two bulls. Two bulls just sitting in there. God, this is so big. We're gonna shoot one of those. We gotta get set up, guys. I think I should, I think I like the, which one are good, is better, do you think? Probably Seth. the one going to the right. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. He's now walking over down towards the right way. What just happened? We just missed a big bull. We didn't miss it. I mean, we, we just didn't get ready in time. Yeah. Yeah. Watched it slowly walk away. Yeah. But it was a big bull, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. It was a big, thick five by five. Yeah. Dang. That <laughs> thing was like. I'll tell you right now. Huge. That bull is much bigger than the five that we've seen last week in the parade. That was the big one, I think. Like the biggest one you've seen? Yeah. Well, there was three big ones that were down here, but we only saw one today. Doesn't mean that they're not around today. We saw two actually, because two of them were slim down there. All that tree over there is blocking our sight. There could be more behind it, and we're just waiting. I mean, if you want, we can, we sh we can walk um, down into that little area and then hike in slowly, but then check it out, but at the same time, We'd have to cross the river, and we don't. I mean, we have our gators, but the problem <laughs> is... You're still getting your wet. Yeah. <laughs> well, we got them on some bowls this morning. I spotted a couple as soon as we sat down. It's getting a little tired of hiking. He has a decent little amount of weight in his pack, so we're going to take all that. We just heard the other kid. Uh, they went up river. We went down. Oh, there's a second shot. Just heard his first shot right before I started filming. There was a second shot, so it sounds like they probably got a bull down. Um, that's the way we were heading anyways. We've seen bigger bulls down here. Oh, third shot. It's three. Yeah, but they, uh, the bulls upriver are staying out all day. Those ones that we spotted just like instantly fed in to the timber. Uh, when the weather is a little bit worse, they're staying out until about 8.30, so we were hoping for that, but they were in the timber by 7.20 this morning, so 
Anyways, keep you guys posted. Hopefully we can get this little guy an elk. One of the other youth hunters with his bull. It's a nice rosy there. These were the shots we heard earlier, for sure. That's yeah. Nice bull, man. Thank you. How far was the shot? Uh, I think it was 400 something. 400, yeah. Yep, yep. Your first elk? Yeah. That's cool. That's my first nice bull, bull, anyways. First bull. How old are you? 14. 14. Nice. You know how many points you had? Uh, six. Six. Heavy. Real heavy, yeah. Yeah. A little bigger than you think, right? Yeah. So how big one you want to shoot? Yeah. Yeah, that's what you're going for. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Congratulations, man. Thank you. Yeah, that's awesome. How far did we hike today? Uh, we hiked uh, 11 miles. Yep. Uh, we're at, we're now gonna go glass at the glassing point and see um if tonight and see if there's any elk over there. Then in the morning we're gonna come back out and see if we can get something big. All right, we moved up to the glassing point. We got, there's five bulls out there. Uh, there's three in this view and two further over to the right. The other youth hunter is, uh, 14 year old girl and we think they're putting a play on them um, you gotta cross the river to get to these guys though so got our first elk of the morning spotted again fortunately there over there and right on the edge of the timber across the river so it's still nice to see a couple too, they're too far away buddy now they're way out in the, right in the timber if you look all the way across yeah just look straight across out there and look like almost behind the alders and they're in there there's like four of them Looks like some cows. I know. I was standing over there. I was looking up and I saw something just standing there. Yeah. It's good to see them, but they're too far for. We're just bouncing away from a little glass and knob. A little glass and knob through here. Looking for the herd of elk. There's like 40 in here yesterday with a few bulls in it. We haven't seen anything yet on this side of the river this morning. Uh, we saw a couple on the other side of the river. I think if Travis gets desperate he might go grab some waders. We'll see. Uh, you know we're just working our way to all these little knobs and glass and Pop out. So we're pretty sure that's a dead elk right there. down there. Yeah, something came through and ate it. So we came up to check out this elk to make sure it wasn't one that somebody wounded yesterday. It's like something killed the animal. Cougar probably. You can tell it's got major hoof rot. Pretty crazy, huh? Yeah. Uh, we had a good day. We uh, we saw a couple of elk, four or five. Uh, they were across the river, and we couldn't get 
pass there to go check them out. We had a fun time. We took a couple of naps, and uh, we played rock, paper, scissors. Uh, my uncle and my grandpa are coming tomorrow to help Glass. They're going to come out and um, uh, try to help Glass from up on top tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So uh, kind of give them some direction on where to go. Yeah, we're going to take a lot slower though tomorrow. Yeah, this guy's, this guy's feet hurt. Yeah, because we hiked both days. Yesterday, my feet were so super sore. We hiked out today and like I can't even move. Yeah. So hope, hopefully they'll, they'll spot some in the morning and, uh, Get a be, and be able to find them. Uh, today was my last day being able to help them. I got to head back home. So. Come on over here, pal. Point it straight up in the air. There you go. Give him a nudge, bud. Yeah, give him a nudge. Just poke him with the end of the barrel. Yep, poke him. Make sure he is down. Yeah, buddy. I guess what? The huh. real work begins now. <laughs> Congratulations, buddy. Nice job, pal. How do you feel? I feel so awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm even awesomer than Austin Powers. <laughs> Dude, nice bull. All right, go ahead and grab those antlers, kid. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do is push hard, and then we'll just slide this tag up. Bam. There's one. Oh, that's all you do is just slide the tag. Well, I just learned that one. You ready? Mm -hmm. Slide it up. Look at that. Got the 23rd. How do you feel right now, though? I feel so awesome. Yeah? This is so cool. All right, congrats, buddy. Thanks.